All right, ladies and gents. So, gonna be doing my post game reaction right now of the France and Moldova game. What another come from behind win for France. Moldova scored the first opening of the game, so it looked like that Moldova was gonna upset France, but then Varana and then finally Giroud sealed the comeback for France. And uh, first, all I could say is in the first 10 minutes of the game, I feel like France played very, very sloppy. But in the second half, uh, well, let's talk about the first half. There were just a bunch of uh, attempts by France to score an equalizer, and they finally did it with Varana. And one thing about Varana is that this guy, pff, he's looking like a very good defender for France. And in the air today, Varana was absolutely incredible. But uh, I'm surprised that Mbappe didn't score a goal today because I thought that Mbappe was going to score. But the biggest issue today in this game was Mbappe's finishing. Like, I feel like that Mbappe's finishing was absolutely just uh, horrendous, and that's the only downside, but uh, Olivier, Olivier Giroud, he ended up seeing the game for France, so it looks like that France, uh, don't be surprised if they win Euro 2020, because this France team, I think, looks still looks very good, but they've been kind of underperforming against Turkey in the qualifiers, but I think that they can um, really uh, go far at the Euros and win another trophy, because with this squad, this France squad looks Euro 2020 ready, and I think this France squad could be even better than the Euro 2016 squad because I'm still trying to figure out how France did not win Euro 2016. They had that game wrapped up, but they just couldn't capitalize on their opportunities, and that's why they lost to a Ronaldo-less Portugal team. So this Euro tournament is going to be France's tournament to see if they can redeem themselves for their failure to win the trophy on their home soil because had France won the trophy four, uh, yeah, four years ago or three years ago, and because now that they won the World Cup, they could have been in... Uh, in consideration among Spain as one of the best international teams of the decade because so far I think that the best teams so far best international teams of this decade from the 2000s is France and Spain because you can easily compare both teams because both teams have won uh, trophies but uh, the only issue is France uh, they didn't win three trophies in a span of four years and if had France won that Euro tournament and uh, but let's see if France can win this Euro tournament because I have a strong feeling that France are likely going to make it to the final because they still look unstoppable even with Kylian Mbappe. And give Mbappe at least another year and he could win the Ballon d'Or next year. Because uh, I think that for Ballon d'Or, without a doubt, Van Dijk or Messi is going to win. But anyways, guys, let me know what you thought about this game. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.